Julia Spencer is a real estate investor with over 25 years experience who owns multiple investment properties. She's a single mother of two who moved to the U.S. in 1993 with only $20 in her pocket. She currently holds an MBA. Julia Spencer is neither a realtor nor an attorney, and the contents of this recording are only her opinions. Get her free guide to investing at juliamspencer.com. I'm your host, Dr. Steve G. Jones, multimillionaire and hypnotherapist. My website is stevegjones.com. Module 6, How to Value a Home. Hey, Julia, uh, along that line, as far as getting the price right, you know, we're looking at uh, comps that are in the area, but if the area is, if the comps are the prices of homes that have sold recently, and recently I'm looking at within the last three to six months, um, if they are so widespread for the same um, size and, you know, other stuff of the house, how do you determine, I mean, do you just take an average of the, the price that's going to fit, or... I mean, how do you determine what, what are you going to use to try to get you to repair value? I mean, what I've been doing is just taking um, the average of everything and the lowest. And, and assuming that, you know, the thing that just sold isn't a, uh, a rehab or something that, you know, someone is trying to put, but something that's actually finished and has residents in it and so on and so forth. So, so what's your quest- question exactly then? You, how do you... Determine what's a fair market value yeah. post post rehab. Yeah, well, how would you determine what's a good um, what's a good comp to use? Um, well, Basically, that's what it comes down to. Okay, well, there's a couple places that you can compare to each other, and then there's a third source that isn't as specific. So first off, you. Um, this is where, where it gets into building your team again. You want to get a couple of realtors on your team that know the area, that have been working there for a while. You don't want somebody that's just been a realtor for a year or something. Somebody that's been looking at all these houses and knows the trends over the last decade or so and has like more of a big picture view and ask them, not just the comps, because the comps will give you just what's the, what's the comparable sales for the last year. But if you, you if you go to a realtor, the realtor that's been working there for a while, they'll know the the switch of up and down over the couple of years. So you want to ask them. You want to look at comps. You want to look at what the tax assessor says it's worth. And I talked to Mo about how to find that online. But it's also the biggest thing is that's going to help you if you're looking in a specific neighborhood. For your free guide to real estate investing, visit juliamspencer.com.